In the current time, navigating through Atlanta traffic, well, it can be a headache. We all know that. But did you know how the tolls on the Georgia Express lanes are calculated? I was curious too, so I went and found out. An absolute disaster. A half hour just to get from 75 to 400. That's ridiculous. 285 southbound at Cobb Parkway shut down from 20 to 75 to 85. For many commuters, those aren't just interstates. It's also the amount of time it takes them to get to work. According to EducatedDriver.org, the average Atlanta driver loses approximately 484 days in their lifetime to rush hour. So I guess it raises the age-old question, how much is your time really worth? The digital Peach Pass signs may have the answer, sort of. But did you ever wonder how they come up with the pricing? There's lots of factors that actually influence what the toll and how the toll is calculated. Amy Gillespie, Director of Engineering for the State Road and Tollway Authority, says those factors include number of vehicles, lane capacity, traffic speed, driver behavior, and tolled distance. All that information is fed into the algorithm and it determines what the toll is going to be. The slower you go, the higher the price will grow. On average, the express lanes are going at least 10 to 15 miles an hour faster than the than the general purpose lane. The lowest Peach Pass users have ever paid is three cents, while the highest is a whopping $17. But you may want to buckle your seatbelt for this. There is no cap as to how high the toll can go. So when it comes to your commute and determining what your time is worth, I guess the decision is sit in traffic and have plenty of time to reflect or live your life in the fast lane.